Hello everybody. Happy New Year and welcome to another video. I've been quiet for a little while because it has been over Christmas and New Year's and all that kind of good stuff. So uh, it is now 2021 and I have uh, possibly my first no I have bought a few plants this year I just haven't shared them um, but this is my first um, big order I guess I can say I've, I've ordered a few plants here and there rambling now um, <laughs> I have a an order here from May Thorani plants which is a an Australian shop obviously because we can't get international um, plants here uh, it all has to go through legit Australian uh, suppliers. So I've got this one here. I have bought four plants and I'm really keen to see uh, how they look. Uh, I haven't ordered from May Therani before, uh, but yeah, we'll see. They've got a really cute website with a little octopus and uh, well, I'm assuming it's an octopus. It could be a kraken or something like that. Um, but I'm just going to open the box. So if you hear any sliding weird noises, that's, that's me turning the box around on the ground. Um, have I done enough to open it yet? Ooh, okay, so we have got a bunch of packing peanuts. <laughs> so I will quickly give you a look at how things are packaged in here. That'll give you a spoiler for one of my plants. So there's a lot of um, packing peanuts. The pots look like they're pretty well stuck in. Uh, so let's go through. Oh, I've just picked, pulled a leaf off my very sick caladium. <laughs> that was bad. It got spider mites on it, so uh, I only found them yesterday, and I don't know how long they were on it. Um, but yeah, it's not looking really healthy. I think I need to go back and prune it, but that's another story for another time. So a lot of these look like they're kind of upside down, but surprisingly, this one still looks pretty good. I cannot remember the name of this one now. <laughs> this is, um, I think it's called Columnia Gloriosa. Or Gloriosa, if I can get it to focus. It's this amazing trailing plant. This was actually the reason I put in the order uh, because they had them uh, a, a little while ago and I missed out. I went on, I kind of deliberated on it for a while and uh, finally went back to buy it and someone else had already ordered it. So <laughs> um, yeah, I missed out the first time and then I signed up for um, their email to let me know when it was back in stock. And yeah, that is why I took a visit to Maytharani this day and put in this order, which I ended up with three extra plants. Uh, I mean, you've got to make the shipping worthwhile, right? I guess that's my excuse. <laughs> On to the next. Okay, what have we got here? Oh, I don't know. I think I know what this one is. So there's a little bit of dirt in here, um, but they have been pretty well uh, uh, topped up. It's a packing peanut in my calathea. So I've got a calathea ornata, which is the Sanderiana, and it's looks like it looks like it's in really good shape. This one kind of dodgy leaf, and one looks like it may have been broken. Uh, but yeah, this is one I've been keeping an eye out for for a while, and I just love the pink the pink um, stripes on this one. So I'm pretty pleased to have this one finally. It's one that I've wanted for quite a while. And as you can see, they've got a tissue here that looks like it's probably moist um, and it's well, pretty well taped up. So there's not a lot of dirt in here, although there's a, li a little bit. I'm pretty, pretty happy with these two so far. All right, I'll get out the one that was kind of spoiled when I showed you, <laughs> when I showed you the box. And this is a uh, Piper Crocatum. I've got another packing peanut so yeah i was a little bit on the fence about getting this one because um to me it's a little bit like um what is it called the scissors discolor which i already have uh and i sort of thought mm, it's probably i'll be fine with just one of them but i have decided that i did want this one so um i can't remember what the i think it's something pepper plant i think is that's sort of common name um but this also is one that will kind of trail i think so i have to have another <laughs> another little, little look to see how these ones grow uh, but yeah it's got these beautifully patterned leaves and my camera won't focus for me today so i'm struggling a little bit <laughs> so there you go that's my piper crocatum and my battery is flashing at me so i'm going to have to go and change that which is just fantastic seeing I only have one plant left to share. Okay, now that I've got a refreshed button, uh, <laughs> button, battery, uh, I'll show you my final one. And it looks like it's actually been quite taped up. Um, and this is another one that I was kind of not 
not sure if I really wanted to get it. It's very wrapped up. That might give you a clue if you know that acronym. Uh, yeah, so this is a variegated chain of hearts and I don't know how I'm gonna get into this to show you. Um, I have a regular green one and I was always kind of like, yeah, I don't need the pink one. I don't need the variegated one. And then it's like, the more I saw it, I just kind of decided that I wanted it. So it looks like they're all kind of wound up here. You can see that it's all kind of wound up on top. Um, so I don't know if I'm going to be able to get these out quickly while we are here. But it looks like it's got quite a bit of growth on it. I wonder how many how many rhizomes are in here. I'm not sure. It's quite a few chains. So either they're just very... Um, uh, virile uh, rhizomes or um, there's a lot of a lot of rhizomes in here they're a little bit tangled which I'm gonna have to fix um, later so there you go um, there's my variegated chain of hearts so all in all I have to say I'm really pleased uh, with this order um, it came really quickly they only shipped it I think two days ago um, because Express Post, which is supposed to be next business day within capital areas, um, because of COVID and people ordering lots of stuff, um, it's a little bit slower than normally it would be. So these were in, ended up being in the post for a couple of days. But yeah, they, they all look pretty good, I have to say. Um, and I'm, I'm pretty pleased that I chose to buy, um, order from Maytharani Plants. It's a, a good experience. So thank you very much to Maytharani Plants and I'm going to go and open up these the rest of the way and uh, and uh, find some spots for my new plants so thank you so much for watching uh, please give it a like if you enjoyed it and remember to subscribe if you want to see more planty goodness and uh, again thank you so much for watching and I will catch you in the next one bye